Mr. Speaker, farm safety legislation is one of the reasons that I ran for election. I knew the Conservatives were dragging their feet on farm worker safety for far too long, and the wild rose was not to be trusted when it comes to workers' rights. Only our Honourable Premier and the NDP would provide the kind of leadership to tackle this issue in a way that is fair and reasonable for a group of workers who have been denied these rights based solely on their occupation. When formulating my decision whether to support this policy direction, I turned to the evidence. The evidence was overwhelming. The evidence was also heartbreaking. I learned that of the roughly 18 deaths per year, they were preventable, Mr. Speaker. And I learned that for every death that occurred, there were 25 hospital admissions and 11 trauma admissions. I've seen some of those accidents firsthand in the operating room, degloving injuries and people run over by combines. I also learned that over the last several years, the agricultural sector has had the highest fatality rate among all occupations in Alberta, and it's on the rise. What's more is that injuries in this sector are underreported we don't even know the true magnitude of this problem. After examining the evidence, the status quo is simply not acceptable to me. A wise man once told me that history isn't just a thing of the past, it is also a thing of the present. That we are always making history, right here and right now. On that note, I'd like to leave a question in the minds of my honourable colleagues. What side of history do you want to be on? I know that I want to be on the side of history where I can look back and be proud of the fact that I supported equal rights for all employees regardless of their occupation. Yeah.